I chose this program because the world is getting really urbanized. People are moving from the rural areas to um, the urban areas and um, understanding how the resources within these areas are utilized to improve um, quality of life and also um, to be used maximally. If this is not done, if this is not done, then you find out that places would uh, go out of uncontrollable growth and it will lead to slums and it's not sustainable at all. So um, I chose this program, Strategic Urban Regional Planning, because it looks into the future. It's, it caters for people who can't plan for themselves. It caters for those who are currently living and then it helps me maximize the resources within the, the environment. Yes, an average week on my program is exciting because it starts off with lectures and then I have seminars and um, if I'm done with seminars, the next week is maybe a workshop or project work and project work is like one of the most exciting things I've done also within a week because we get to immerse ourselves into um, the area or the case study that we are studying and it's fun. Okay, so project work is basically going to a field study to analyze some of the global challenges that exist within an environment and how to prefer solutions to those changes. And it's it's more like a combining your theory with the practical aspects of what you're training to become in the field and it's quite exciting. You get to engage your creative sense, you get to engage your the educational aspects of it also and then you get to understand more of the principles that you've learnt um, from the lecturers and from the study guides. What I like the most about my program is how the, is the synergy between practicality and theoretical and theory. So um, it's one thing to learn the theory, it's another thing to know how to apply the theory. So, and that's like the best thing because um, I see most people come out and don't know how to be effective with the theory or how to apply themselves in the in practical sense and that's that's what this program gives me. Interesting right now uh, I found interesting was the theories um, because some of them I had not known but when I got to learn about them and understand them I got to understand oh so this was what was applied in this sense so it's made me understand the framework better and then now I'm dealing in public administration, understanding bureaucracy, understanding the role of the politician and understanding my role as a planner also. And that's interesting. My dream job, hopefully to be a professional planner um, who would leave and my imprint in my urban in urban design across the world, wherever I'm needed, where places need to be designed more. Hopefully, work with the World Bank, um, with the UN, um, have my own practice also, and just basically travel the world, leaving an imprint. You see, oh, okay, this is the signature of how this place was planned, and this was who planned it, this was the idea behind the plan, making it global for everybody. The best thing about studying Liu is the networks you get to create, is the networks you get to form along the line. You form these networks with your lecturers, you form these ne networks with your colleagues, you form this, you, you get to understand the practical aspects 
and you are fortified with your education, the theory also. And I think that's very valuable because you, you, you can't, as a planner, you can't act independently. You need to have the knowledge of all these actors to be able to prefer or make better decisions. Yes, um, as an international student, I didn't have where to stay, so Combo was the first support service that helped me through my first month, providing accommodation for me. And there I got to meet very incredible people who will form bonds now going forward. Um, we've traveled to some cities within Sweden together where uh, we get to support each other the best way we can. Um, uh, also, the campus bus um, that gets to take us from here to North Shopping, it was very valuable when I was doing my project work um, because I get to analyze some aspects of what I needed to be done in my case study in North Shopping and the campus bus provided that, that accessibility. Yes, um, for future students, you'd need to be patient first. And um, when applying, you need to properly research, um, research your learning techniques, um, understand how you want to learn, because it's, if you're an international, it's obviously different. Um, a learning style from where you're coming from to Liu. And, Researching about that will give you an upper hand. Also, look at the syllabus of what you are coming to learn. Understand if this is what you want and if it applies to your future concerns. Other than that, yeah. Just, just go for it. <laughs> First, geography. And um, being one of the largest countries in the European Union, it has somewhat a small population, so it was going to be easy to integrate properly into, into, into um, Sweden. Also, it's one of the leading manufacturers, um, and that says well with the economy also. And Sweden happens to be a um, one of the greenest cities in Europe also and uh, my love for nature is, is, is amazing so it was, a, it was an easy match for me to come to Sweden. I chose Liu because it's one of, it, it inspires innovation and um, research, cross, especially cross-border research. Um, also, when I was doing my research, Liu students are desirable. I mean, immediately I put Liu on my LinkedIn page. I most of the organizations you actually see Liu alumni there, and that says well. And also the di the diversity aspects of it, having to um, accept diverse cultures, diverse nationalities, makes Liu one of the most comfortable places you can learn. And then the fact that everybody here speaks English, that also is something that will help you integrate properly. Mm -hmm.